Dr. Yang, you mind checking in on some of my post-op CR swamp traumas? Also, would you like to go on a date with me? I'm sorry? Uh, date? You said not to play hot and cold with you, so, um, I'll pick you up around eight. Oh, and make sure Mr. Kenner in room 2212 gets that enema he's been holding on to it for days. <clears throat> okay. Because that wasn't weird. <laughs> Rogai. Oh, he's pissing me off. He's blossoming brain contusions now, and he's refusing surgery. You think this is going to get him a stay of execution? No. He'd just like to die here. He wants to control it, wants to choose. I oh. went a little overboard buying bears for your nieces. Mom, this is Major Owen Hunt. Major? I was a Navy nurse for 25 years. Where were you stationed, Major Hunt? In the thick of it, in Iraq. Welcome home. You must have stories. Not any worth telling. I finished your post ops. Thank you, Dr. Yang. So, what was your best surgery ever? What? Nothing. I'm uh, stupid. Good night, Mrs. Shepard. Nice to meet you. Major Hunt? How have you been sleeping? I'm sorry? When I can't sleep, I use valerian root. I know you doctors don't think much of herbs, but I find it helps. Have you been sleeping since you came back? Uh, I'm fine, ma'am. I sleep just fine. Good night. You're late. You're really late. They probably closed the kitchen. I didn't want you to think that I stood you up. Are you drunk? I haven't been on a date in five years since before I entered the military, and I, I just wanted to take the edge late off. Late and drunk? You are late and drunk? I will make this up to you, I promise. This is not what you deserve. I know this is not what you deserve, and I will make this up to you. I, I promise. Okay, before you say anything else, Dr. Goodtimes, you need to shower. You smell like a distillery. Right. No, not here. I... Yeah! Yeah! I thought of my best surgery. I'm wearing shoes in my shower. My first blast injury in the field, body was uh -huh. mangled. Homemade explosive device, copper and wires embedded five inches deep in the abdomen, arms and legs hanging on by threads of skin. Never seen anything like it. Not in a textbook, not in residency. Incredible body full of holes. Trauma surgeon shooting. I put tourniquets on where I could, started tying off the arteries with my bare hands, but the bleeding was everywhere, stomach, chest. Best pressure I could think of was my own body, so I, I laid there for two hours on top of him, just not moving, trying to keep that dam from bursting with my hands and knees and my elbows. Body, little hole in there. He never bled out. I wouldn't let him. He made it to the hospital. He made it home. A month later, he sent me a letter thanking me for saving his life, and then he shot himself. That was my best surgery. You sure to die. Come on, boys. And his body will break. We're human. We make mistakes. Into the night. We misestimate. We call it wrong. He will 